that all letters sent home was censored. They tell us to write letters home to our parents, which made us very happy because it was the only contact we had with our parents is some letters sent home. In my letters, I had tried to explain the abuse that was happening in residential schools. For me, it is very hard to talk about it. I didn't even talk about the abuse in residential schools to my children. And today they're shocked to hear all what is happening, especially finding of the babies. And I, I told my youngest daughter, no, I didn't want you to know what happened to me. I was ashamed to be a Sukhwapmukhoi. That's what residential schools taught me, to be ashamed of my identity. After walking the red road and learning who I was, which took many years in pushing back the abuses of residential schools, to learn of my identity. As many of us know how hard it is that have gone to residential schools. The residential schools were specifically built to take the Indian out of us, to take away our language, culture, and traditions, and to make us some astute 